Why hello there, boom, welcome back to a new video, Frosty Vlogs. You hear that? Frosty Vlogs. It's me. It's me. So you wonder what this video is about. I mean, you could read the title obviously, but this video is about how my semester one has been. Semester one. I'm already halfway through this uni thing. Oh my days, it's mental. It's gone way too quick. It's been like this. Literally went, wah. And now I'm here making a video. I still remember Freshers Week was so blessed. Oh my days, the amount of pizza I ate was ungodly. Oh, oh my days, it was beautiful. I really miss them days where free Domino's pizzas and free McFlurries. The free tea as well. Mmm, it's nice. I really do miss it. Anyway, nah, this video is just literally about me waffling about how my semester one was doing at Nottingham University. Brussels group, woo! But yeah, nah. Um, on a real thing, uni's been great fun. You meet so many different people. You experience different things you wouldn't experience anywhere else at university. But here, it's just been one crazy roller coaster, literally and metaphorically, and whatever way there is. Anyway, um, now on a real thing. So, for, so let me just go through it on a timeline basis. Yeah. So. There's no animations there because I'm not good at that stuff yet. Give me some time, give me some time. Anyway, so number uno, Freshers Week, beautiful, beautiful. Yeah, then the first week of academics or week two basically of uni, it was like you start learning your stuff, you get introduced to people. Okay, great fun. Okay, I respect that, nice. But you do work as well. So you need to make sure you revise I did revise, but not as like I should have at the very beginning. Because I, I'm thinking, ah, first week, what harm is there? What harm is it? It is the very first week. Chill. Why not chill? Finish. Let me go home sleep. Yeah, but no, I was wrong. I was so wrong. <laughs> I've never been more wrong in my life ever. Oh my God. Mental. This whole uni thing is mental. You don't even understand it. It's, it's different. It's not like college or A level where you can just walk up in there and be like, boom, work, I'm out. But not really A level. A level is tough. But like, that's a thing. But B tech, you know what I mean. With your assignments, you know exactly what I mean when I say do the work, hand it in, last day thing, boom, distinction. But nah, it's not like this at university, friend. Nah, it's not like that, it's not like that, you have to be on it. So, for what I was told here, yeah, by my lecturers, by every, everybody that I know, for every one hour you spend in a lecture, you spend two hours studying in your own time, basically. And, yeah, you just that's just how it goes. But anyway, back to the timeline, I'm just changing topic, let's get back on the main focus. Semester one, semester one. So, great start, then got to week four, like, okay, I understand it, but, like, I need to revise more. Then we, so it goes, mm, mm, ooh, week four, because of my little test and that midterm. It went okay, could have been better. It could do, well, actually, it wasn't that bad, but still. It carries on, then, for some reason, ah, oh, just hit me. I felt so, I was, I want, oh, how do I put it? See how people say uni is like, Oh, it's a great experience, hey, great fun, great fun, new experience, oh, yeah. It is. However, you forget. It's not club, it's not party, it's not an event, it's not an adventure. It is an adventure, but you get what I mean? Like, it's not, not playtime, it's work time. It is work time. Especially if you're doing a heavy subject, which, like, engineering or maths or physics or, like, some science thing. They are heavy. They're like, it's like a meaty sandwich. It's just a heavy subject. It's like, oh, just out of nowhere. But nah, it's just been, what was I saying? Oh, oh. so anyway, back into it, yeah. So yeah, nah, it's been going well, but then it just hit me. I felt so depressed. I felt low, cause I was like, ah, I'm not doing as much as I want to. What, what am I doing wrong? Am I revising wrong? Am I doing things wrong? What's going on? And I didn't really speak to people for like two weeks, sort of thing. Not like I spoke to people, but like I didn't want to be, oh yeah, let's hang out, oh, let's do that. Mentally, I wasn't on it. Mentally, I just didn't want to do it because my mind was like, 
of, oh, what if I fail my exams in January? What if I fail this? What if I fail that? What if I'm too late to this? What if I'm too late to that? What happens if I do this? What happens if I do that? It was crazy. My mind was all over the place. I couldn't focus on studies for like two weeks. It was dark, it was like dark times. Batman dark, like Gotham dark. If you get what I mean, like dark times. But now in the martial arts, uh, it's got, uh, sorry, I'm lost for words here. Sorry. But um, then um, it got better because I started speaking to my cousin because she did A-levels. Shout out to Anaya, by the way. So I spoke to my cousin here yeah, and um, we had a nice talk for like 10, 20 minutes and it really did boost my confidence. You really do need to talk to someone at uni because you're here by it. Like if you're like going far away for uni or education or a different country, <coughs> you really do need to talk to someone as cheesy as that sounds. Like everybody has their highs and lows in life. I hit a really bot like bottom stage. I've never felt before in my life ever. I've never felt that in my life and at uni by myself feeling that you feel miserable, you feel, you feel broken. You actually do feel broken. It's very hard to describe. You feel bad, you feel disgusting. I, I, I felt disgusting, I didn't do any work. I was lazy, I felt dark, depressed sort of thing. But when you speak to someone, it really does broaden your horizon because like, imagine getting stressed from people saying, oh, you must pass. Ooh. Oh, look at that person there, it must pass. Oh, oh, is that frosty? Yeah? You need to pass first year. Oh, and then you're like, mentally, I'm already struggling. Leave me alone. Well, you can't say that, can you? But to certain people, but um, now you really do need to talk to someone. That's my advice. If there's one thing I picked up from university, you really do need to talk to someone. There's always has to be like people that you trust and then you can speak to about your problems openly. That's literally what you need in life, to be honest. I mean, till this day, until recently, to me, that's never really concerned me. But until then, yes, it really did. You really do need to talk to someone. But no, that happened for like two weeks. Then I spoke to the person, then it brought my morale back, and then back to work on that progress thing. So it was going really well, and then <coughs> now I'm here. So that's why my videos have been shit as well. I know they really have been. It was like forced because I had no energy. Back with the energy. You get me? Anyway, now I just like now I feel more like myself. I feel more lively. I'm ready to grind on this work, YouTube thing, and my studies as well. Because studies is number one, lads. Ladies and gentlemen, studies is number one. If you want to make it anywhere, that's not well. A lot of people say that's not really true, but for me, that's how it's gonna be. That's how I'm gonna say it. Da, da, da. Anyway, now nah, literally, you need to study, you need to work hard, work hard for it, literally. I mean, I'm, I'm, I'm not even that smart, I'm not even that smart, and I made it to Nottingham University. Mechanical engineering, ah, different. But yeah, nah, you really do need to work hard for it. So even now, I really do need to work hard for it, because in December, yeah, I'm going to three different weddings within two weeks in a foreign country. Pakistan and I'm flying there by myself that's gonna be a vlogger journey as well it's gonna be different it's gonna be fun but I need to balance out gym studies and the wedding thing and the dance thing here are all my days you better go easy on me I know you're watching this year you better go Liba 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 you better go easy on me Inaya you leave me alone and Dawa how dare you make me dance and Shani you're taking my place I just want to say that now Anyway, nah, like, on the real thing, it went from, so university life basically went from, ee, oh, midterms, okay, week five to week six, ee, whoa, shut down, two weeks, chat to people, get moral support, da, 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 now I'm back on the grind, a bit higher than before, I feel more better, I feel more better about myself, it's such a beautiful feeling, but, um, yeah, no, I'm just literally, that's how my semester one's been, I mean, the course is hard and all. I've got a lot of exam, a lot of exam. Midterms, look to, actually no, that's like exams because everything counts. Everything I do, little tests and stuff every week that counts for my final grade. Great, counts for my final grade. But yeah, no. Uh, inshallah, it goes well. I have my exams in January. I need to revise. And also one more thing. Merry Christmas 
to all you people out there celebrating Christmas. Merry Christmas. Even if you don't celebrate it, I hope you have a wonderful holiday, a wonderful life, a wonderful future, a wonderful family, wonderful work, wonderful something. Just something that's wonderful. Anyway, I'm just gonna go do my Secret Santa thing because that's what's happening in a bit. You're not gonna see it, but just know this is what my gift is looking like. Don't judge me. One second. It is a car. Okay. Whoa, that's what you get to see. If you can guess what that was, yeah. I will send this to you by post. If you can comment correctly what items were in that car looking thing of a monstrosity, I will e I will mail this to you first class. That is a promise. Anyway, <coughs> I'm dying here. I'd just like to say thank you for watching. That's how my semester one's been. It went from beautiful to shit, sort of, to beautiful to shit, then to beautiful again. It's been a wide range of, uh, of emotions I felt I've never felt before, never happened before, but that's just what happens in life. But anyway, thank you for watching Frosty Vlogs. Like, comment, subscribe, share. If you don't share, I don't like you. So share the video. Share the video. You have three seconds. Three, two, one. Thank you for watching. Bye-bye. You better like and subscribe. Whoop.